What is up guys, Canon CGHQ here, and today we're doing another 555 tower, and that tower is going to be the magnificent, the wonderful Spike Factory. So we can start by putting him down, also not forgetting about Benjamin up here in the corner, and also turning up my FX. And if you guys haven't seen this video before, make sure to go back and watch all the other 555s. But basically what I do is I get the tower, I get the 555, see how far it's able to go, and then I god boost it with the god village. And if you haven't yet already, make sure to subscribe. I am currently trying to hit 10,000 subs before the end of the year, so any little bit helps. And as we're hopping straight into this, I know this uh, base spike factory should be able to handle things at least for a while. Enough for me to get my farming up and going. So I'll see you guys in a couple rounds. Okay, it's round 18. Even though I don't have to, I am just going to upgrade this guy. I'm going to get white hot spikes. And once we pop some more things, I'm going to get faster production, even faster production, and then long life and smart spikes. And if I'm able to get smart spikes, come on. But I feel like we're easily going to destroy round 40 because before then I'm going to get a 333. And then I'm just going to see how long the 333 can survive. And honestly, I'm going to put this on far. So it has as much time to build up things. And I will see you guys on round 40. Hey, we actually did lose some lives. So I'm just going to put it back on normal. Maybe smart spikes was not a great idea. But right here, I can get monkey Wall Street, which makes that so much better. And uh, just because I'm able to, let's just get the 333, which hopefully it means it can build up spikes for a round and it also increases the tiers. It carries over one round, but I feel like we should be more than capable of easily handling this. And especially once we get up to the 444 and then the 555, I know this is going to be one of the laggiest towers yet. But if I just speed it up a little bit just to get to round um, 39, so we can easily beat round 40. So right here. And just because I can, if I put it on far, it, everything goes right there. Which, is there a better, smart, normal. Honestly, there's really not a better placement for this and I can get Banana Central. And we insta bought the Moab. So I will see you guys when this 333 dies. Okay, so this got not as far as I thought. Only around 49. But honestly, if I make this a 444 and just hit play, this should do way better against this round. And we should easily be able to take this down now. Especially since they explode when they lose all their bikes, which is nice. And honestly, I can sell Benjamin. But I just want to make sure, yeah, we're easily popping everything now. So now I will see you when the 444 dies, which I'm guessing is around 85. Okay, I was so close yet so far. Round 84 was around. But we can get the 555, which is going to lag the crap out of my computer. But if we just go like this... Sorry for that interruption, but once the spike ability activates which it's every 15 seconds, we should easily, yeah. No, this is going to be the laggiest thing ever. <laughs> and I still have to God boost it. And it's already covering the track. Oh, okay, so let me just turn down the FX ever so slightly. So when the explosions happen, but I'll see you guys on round 98. Okay, it's round 98. Some things actually came out, but mostly they're popping right there. This guy has 1.7 million. Uh, pops and 98 is slowly but surely getting popped around 99 and let's see how fast we pop this round 100 bad It got killed by the old ability So my guess is we're gonna get to around 165 and then max buff I don't think my computer is gonna be able to survive that so I may have to call it quits So I will see you guys when this dies Okay, so it is round 225. This tower has not died yet, but there is two things I'm going to do. First, let me turn off auto start. The second thing is, look, when I try to fast forward, it's a slideshow. So what I'm going to do is once this round ends, I'm going to get this village. And I don't need 
I just need one and then uh, three right here. Now he has that. And then I'm just going to put it on smart because then I I'm going to put him on close. And then also I need two villages right here for homeland called the arms. And then I also need one engineer, a sub up here which sadly I will not be utilizing the um, uh, from, I mean the 555 spike factories ability because if I do it probably break my game and I need uh, one where I need one two three four of these text box so if I just go like this what hotkey one two six so six, 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 wait, and let's just see how bad this is. So if I just, oh my, the amount that it's already producing is insane. <laughs> okay, this is normal speed, yet for the homeland buff. And if I speed it up, it goes a little bit faster. The reason I am doing this is also I got to turn on auto start again is the moment seven right no it's six the moment homeland comes off cooldown i mean comes on cooldown i'm going to apply uh the call to arms buff and that'll be 100 percent uptime and what i'm basically going to do is install a mod that allows me to skip around so i'll be right back. okay now that we're back in balloons if we just go back over to logs we were on round 228 but what is magnificent about this mod is if i just go right here and do 299 we're on round 300 i know well more than enough that we will be able to beat this round so it's just the fact of actually beating the round because like how slow everything is this is normal speed and we're having trouble what i could do is oh i it's laggy what i could do is get rid of um middle path and make it a five four five but where's the fun in that oh okay real quick i think i okay i think what i might do is make it a five four five Maybe I'll be able to actually do a time lapse if I do that, and it's not. So if I sell this guy, sad. But if I sell him, put this guy back here, and then just get a five, four, five, have him on close, and then what I can also do is get down another tech bot, and this guy can be attached to that. And if I play the round, it's way less laggy, which is really nice. Oh my. But the moment it starts selling everything, I mean, the moment everything starts exploding, it gets laggy again, which is completely fine. But let's see, three times speed, it is doable. Oh, it's, okay. If I put it on normal, like that, I, I think I'm just gonna, okay. It's not going to be a true 555 test, but I would like to actually be able to use my computer. So what I'm going to do is set a time lapse like this. Yes, it's on close and everything. It doesn't have the ability, but that's completely fine. It, it still lags the crap out of my computer. Oh my, can I use an ability on this guy? There we go. But yeah, I'll set up a time lapse and see if there's anything else I can do to make it less laggy. It seems, well, one, I'm at um, 25 times, so see you guys when this dies. Or my computer can't handle it anymore. <laughs>
25 years. No, it's actually been a lot. Total damage, 1 billion. That's crazy. Can I... Okay, let's just hit review map. This thing got 596 million pops, which is insane. This got zero. This guy got 450. This guy got 900. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to smash the subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next video.